It's convenient to live downtown. You can uh, walk to the square, you can go over to Washington Park, you can get on the streetcar, ride down to Finley Market, uh, catch a bus to any part of the city of Cincinnati. The barrister thinks it can provide affordable housing in one of the city's most expensive places to rent. Leasing manager Cynthia Belt says Wi-Fi is included. It's fully equipped with appliances and washer and dryer hookups. It makes it affordable because we're able to house individuals that have vouchers, uh, individuals who income may not allow them to have an apartment of this uh, magnitude with these kind of amenities. We saw two staged apartments. One was a 730 square foot unit with two bedrooms for about $1,200. The other, 780 square feet with three bedrooms for roughly $1,600. The developer says it's expensive to fund low income housing. But yeah, these projects are getting increasingly more difficult to put together just because this, this was a very expensive acquisition, a very expensive um, acquisition cost just to acquire buildings downtown. Affordable housing advocates say there needs to be more places like the Barrister. We know that in, as a city we need 28,000 units like this, 28,000. Um, and it takes years to get these 44. Reporting downtown, Paige Barnes, Local 12 News. Now, for comparison's sake here, the average rent for an 860 square foot apartment downtown right now is 1860 a month. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.